pull the module out. These are Torx 20s. There's uh, three on this side, three on that side. And then there's this connector here that's uh, typical of BMW. You lever this out and it kind of uh, levers itself out of the connector, latches out. Pretty nice. And then to remove this, you, after the screws are removed, you just simply pull it straight away like that. And that's what you're left with. And here's a look at the inside of it. There's all these uh, coils that are, looks like they're free floating. And there's something blackened here. I'm not sure what happened there, but it uh, doesn't look good down in this area. But I'll take a look at it and see if I can do anything about it. And there's also two uh, spring feelers here, looks like. Looks like they connect right here on these pads. And so this is the module. Going to be, uh, you can see the sticker, it's been repaired before. Back in uh, 2010, I think. So I'll take it in and take a look at it and see. They say you can uh, drive the car, and we actually did drive it before. Just covered this up with aluminum foil in a bag to protect it. And did the same with this connector. And what uh, from what happened before, I sent the module to be repaired. They sent it back to me, and I just installed it and uh, connected it up. And the ABS light just was out, and it stayed out for many, many years, maybe 10 years or so. So um, that's the that was my experience previously. If I sent it to Modules Masters, they probably would do the same thing again. Repair it, send it back, I install it, and uh, they said it was okay to drive it around without, I mean, I don't have ABS now, so just removing it would be okay, they said. Um, just protect the connector from, you know, water or dirt or dust. And do the same with this um, block here, these solenoid I don't know what these things are. I guess they're valves inside of there. I'm not sure what goes on with that. They don't seem to move. Evidently, there must be a little... I don't really know what, what goes on inside of this thing. But these coils seem to activate them. Electromagnetically, I'm guessing. 